Hey guys, I'm Brave Blast, and you're here for the next episode of the Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword. In the last episode, we defeat the Ancient Cistern, even though I kind of left the chest un um, uncounted for. Yeah, but who cares? That chest can go dying in a hole or in a temple, because that's where it is, actually. And, Tree, you're in my way. Even though you weren't actually in my way, I just like destroying things. Ha 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 ha. Okay, you. Oh, my batteries are gonna die soon, so I might want to turn my rumble off, but. No rumble. Oh gosh! I just realized those things are modeled after the the actual life IRL thing that like sticks into you and tries to murder your face hole. That's great. I had one of those on my leg um, Monday and didn't notice it. And I was doing setups for cross country practice, and then I realized and I looked down and saw it, and I was like, ah 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 ah! It hurt like balls, man. It hurt like balls. Oh gosh! I don't know, but well. Never mind, I'm not talking about this. <laughs> okay, so in this episode, we need to head back to Skyloft, yeah. Normally, to continue the story, we would need to head back to the Isle of Songs, but today we're going to be heading back to Skyloft because there's stuff I want to get done here. Okay, so now that we're searching for the Sacred Flames, we could go buy a new shield. That is much better than the one we have now, but that's going to be 500 rupees. And let's face it, I don't have 500 rupees. So, before we do anything... Oh, someone... STOP CALLING ME! LEAVE ME ALONE! Okay, I'm back, sorry about that. My friend John called me just so he could inform me... Ouch, Link, you okay? Well, he called me to inform me that he was buying... Um, I think it was 3.8 ounces of Swedish fish for $10. Which I guess is a good deal, I'm not sure, but I'm guess I guess so. Sounds like it. Sounds pretty good, two bags of fish for ten dollars. Huh, I don't know about the Swedish fish though. I'm very Swedish. From the Bahamas man. How many fish we got there? Fish. Like Bahamas fish. I probably sound really stupid right now, but you know, whatever. And that goddess chest we had um a, f a couple hundred rupees. Oh, so we got another one over here apparently. And I think I know how to get that one. So, oh, you have something to say, don't you? Hey there, Keen. Thanks again for the stamina potions. You get to me. I've been doing push-ups like a machine. You'll see. We tough as you in no time. Okay. And we also need to go back and talk to Fledge because apparently now that we finished ancient ancient cistern, we can finish his. Well, not finish, but go take him another stamina potion because let's face it, that guy needs more than one. He's nowhere close to being us. And if you come into this whole oh gosh, that sounded so wrong. If you and I'm not even gonna repeat it, no. I, that's how wrong it was. Ah dump! I meant to say jump, but I said dump. And there's a regular chest in here. What is in this chest? What is why is the phone ringing so much? We got another silver rupee, it's worth a hundred rupees. You must feel like a celebrity. Actually I don't, because I've had more. And another chest! But this one's glowy, so it's better. Glowing is better, kids. We got a piece of art! Collect four and increase our damn! Because it's three to go! Woohoo! And there, let's face it, there's one hard piece in particular that I'm not looking forward to. Like, you know, every Zelda game has that hard piece that no one wants to. No one wants to spend their time doing. And I'm not looking forward to that one, mostly because I've never done it successfully. And I'm already bad at this game. But now I'm kind of torn. Because if we can't find more rupees, we are going to be screwed thoroughly. Oh, that sucks. Dang it. No. Anyway, why am I in here? I don't even know why I'm in here. That's ridiculous. We need to be going to the bazaar, and apparently I can't find where that is. What's wrong with me? Ah, ah, ah. Nah, throw, throw me, mommy, Bobby. I always call my mom. I wonder if one day she'll like be inside the house and be like, "Hakeem, what's wrong?" I'm like, "Oh, nothing. I was just playing a game for the internet." And then she'll be like, "Oh, you're a loser." And then I'll be like, "Yeah, I am." Anyway, so that's that shield over there, but it costs 500 rupees. But we need to go get a stamina potion for Fledge, so we can give him a stamina potion. And then he can do more push-ups and stop being a little girl. Yeah, 
That's what I wanted to say. I don't try to cur I try not to curse my videos. Like sometimes my talking like leans towards it, but then I try to like avoid it. So my videos are appropriate and everything, and cursing's not good and everything. Yeah, like that. And that guy is something to say that's not important because we're gonna go take care of that right now. Actually, see, I don't need fancy hints by the game. All I need is my manliness to find out what to do, and it's not even required. That's how boss I am, girl. <laughs> okay, <laughs> now that I'm done talking weirdly, we can come inside this door. That sounded much more appropriate. And once you inside this door, you can talk to this guy. Hey, I just checked Gris's room and the guy's gone again. Here he went. Maybe he had to run because of his broken heart. What a tough guy. Hey, <laughs> hey. You know what? I screwed up. I'm sorry. I'll be right back. You know what? I didn't screw up. Never mind. What we need to do is we need to go into our room and go to sleep. Because sleep is important. And then inside our room... Boop, 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 boop. Listen to that music, man. Five rupees! Someone's been coming into our room and dropping five rupees in there. I like how it's just dropping to your wallet in our wallet. It's just like a pouch. That's so stupid. How long do you want to sleep? Until night! And that leads to my, to my other question. How big are rupees? Like... Are they as big as they are in the game? Or, like, real life, like, how big are they? Like, what would be accurate representation? I'd say they're about the size of, like, a computer of a mouse. Like a, like a, not a mouse, mouse, the animal. I mean, like, the mouse you use to scroll around your computer. Okay. So, now we need to go. Wait, wait, wait. Let's go to Fledge's room first. And give him stamina potion so we can get this over with. Okay. Uh, 55, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50. Oh, well, I'm sweating up a storm. I'm gonna eat my game. I've been training hard ever since I spoke, but I still feel those like it. Maybe I would run out of energy. Yeah, you sure have. I can't even understand that. I'll give you another stamina potion you're carrying. No, it's not. Twenty minutes of. Take some. Jeez. Really, what makes like the girl you think they died? Cause that's what everyone sounds like when they're tired. Yeah, your muscle again huge, dude. Woohoo! That's the Star Wars like a refreshing splash of energy! And that's what people sound like when they're energetic. Sometimes I worry, though. All this training never results. All I need to train before I start to get stronger. What do you think, Akeem? How many push-ups do you think I need to get strong? Not about numbers! It's not about numbers, of course! Maybe I should just keep up with that until I forget how many I've done, right? I get that make that. Now that I know that, I'll definitely start getting stronger. Come back soon so you can see how I'm doing. And wow, I completely butchered his speech. I gave him like three different voices. And now that we've done that, we need to go to the bathroom. In the bathroom. Ooh. Ooh, somebody. Please, somebody help me. It's locked, dun dun dun! Ooh, paper! Somebody, somebody bring me some paper, please! Any kind of paper at all, ooh! Dude, you could be an R&B singer. Like, totally. Okay, so now that we've done that, we need to just go back to our room and wake up in the morning. Oh, I wonder how long this... <laughs> I'm actually making better progress in this video, though, so... Because I tried recording this early, but it might have got interrupted. And I decided to, to just scrap the recording. Because it wasn't going that well anyway. I was doing pretty bad on time. But I've actually gone farther normally. And I got interrupted for like 5 minutes on a phone call. So i actually doing pretty good. I'm not even mad at the guy for calling me. It's just... Aw, oh, there's nothing useful in here. I'm not mad at him for calling me. Uh, it was actually pretty funny. <laughs> I just wish... My only regret is I didn't leave the mic on so you can hear it. Aw. Oh well. So anyway... Oh, I said anyway. Da, 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 that's bad. We have this guy. What's something you're saying? Hmm, should I give it to her? Should I not give it to her? Lava! Hakeem, it's you. Don't sneak about me like that. I have a serious dilemma on my mind right now, and you're distracting me. Dilemma? 
What? You want to hear about it? Hmph. Normally I would never ever tell someone like you, but these are dirt dire times. I almost said dirty times. Come to think of it, you might be just the person I need. You seem to be pretty good with the ladies. Oh, I am. Ugh, I can't believe I just said that. But whatever, let's do this. Hakeem, I have a task for you. Uh, oh, so does everyone else. Get in line. So listen up, your mission is to take this piece of paper to a certain person. It's a very important piece of paper. Make sure you deliver it. <laughs> he just looks at the bathroom. Huh? What's your problem? Why are you looking at the restroom? What? There's someone in the restroom at night who wants paper? You fool! Fools! You remind me of Excalibur. That's not good. I put my heart into every word. I guess you could say it's sort of like a alright, fine, it's a love letter. And that's why you will not, under any circumstances, ever allow it to be used as toilet paper. Do you hear me? I hear you loud and clear. I just don't care. So listen up. The person you must give it to is a girl. Oh. I'm sorry. I thought it was a guy. You know who I mean, right? She's the one with the round hat. Oh. Couldn't read that because my sucky TV is quality. She's really cute. You know the one. And don't you dare, not even by mistake, even think of giving it to that weirdo in the restroom. Swear it. Here it is. I'm addressing this letter to you, so don't read what's inside. Do you hear me? No, I don't. You received Colin Colin's letter. Can you believe this letter might actually contain heartfelt words from Colin? Take extra care that you don't end up using a scrap paper. Oh, I sure will. All right. I am not your sidekick. And now that we've done that, we need to go back to our room and sleep until it's night time. So let's go do that. Man, this game requires a lot of sleeping. Like that, I think it's really cool though that you have to actually take the time to go and sleep if you want to progress in the game. That's really cool. It's cool, cool. It's cool as school. Alrighty, I was only planning on making this video 15 minutes so my computer wouldn't like fill up with videos files, but oh well. I'll have to take the extra time to do this. I know it's not in 15 minutes, but it's around there. And I'll open the restroom. Ah, uh, paper! You brought me some paper! I'll open the door, please come in! Oh gosh, what are we gonna see behind this door? Oh, 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 it's the hand from Majora's Mask. Dude, when did Majora's Mask come out? Because seriously, you still need paper? How dirty is your dump? Ooh, paper, I need paper. I'm not angry or anything, I just need some paper. And you are, huh? You're giving me paper? I'm so happy. You totally look like Garham's hand. But this looks like someone's letter. Are you sure you can have this? Yeah, sure, why not? Thank you, I will use it with care. But I'm shy, so don't ask me what I want the paper for. Maybe meet again, you kind soul. And he retracts into the toilet. So now that we've done that, let's go sleep in someone else's room until nighttime. Let's go sleep in Fledge's room because Fledge doesn't need a bed. He's doing push-ups. You better not interrupt me while I'm sleeping. Let's sleep until night time. Okie dokie. Dude, I like Fledge's room. It's pretty cool. And I like how Lynch is like, I'm the only person who will ever lay in this bed. Okay, now that we've done that, that's good, sir. We shall go find... What is his name? He should be in Groose's room. That's what I read. And what? What now? It came tonight. My head is swimming with thoughts of Korean. You need to talk to me about something. Can we wait till tomorrow and I get lost? And but why are you in Gross's room? That doesn't make any sense. Anyway, let's sleep until morning. Hopefully that'll fix everything. I'm not exactly sure, but what can you do? Not much actually. So until morning. There's the music, oh my gosh. Yes, I love it. Loves it so much. Okay, link, 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 link. Get out the door. Okie doke. So now, 
in Groose's room. Is he in here? No. Dude! You just have one of these in your room? Why do you... What's with you? Jeez! Man! Seriously? Do you really need those to be in your room? Like, can they not just have this at the academy in general? Oh well. Oh, I guess we gotta talk to him. Hey, Keem, did you hand over that letter like I asked? Actually... What? What did you just say? You gave it to that weirdo in the restroom? Did I specifically tell you not to give it to the weirdo in the restroom? Seriously, that's it like five times. I know I did. You fool, all good. You're anyone who belongs to the path of true love deserves to be kicked by a bird. I hate you, a cave. Ah! <laughs> it's scream. Oh my god. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. That was so funny. Like, he just screams like a little girl. Oh man. I am totally glad to time of my day to do that. Ugh. That was great. Goodness gracious, that was beautiful. Okay. Anyway. Now that we've done that, we need to head over to Groose's room. And after you finish this little side quest thing, I think we'll be done for today. Hey look, it's the hand. You're just a hand. Ah, you're the one from the other day. It's good to see you again. Actually, thanks to you, I met my true love. Yes, him. It all started with that letter you gave me. Those beautiful words of affection that caused me to fall hopelessly in love. Ah, uh, my heart is bursting with thoughts of him. I feel so excited, so cheerful, so full of life. And? You got five gratitude crystals. These crystals are feelings of gratitude in crystallized form. Oh, really? Woo! Five crystals. So we have 35 now. Woohoo! Ah, my love, I will always be here by your side. Tee hee! Okay, so that's pretty much it for that. So now that we've finished that, there's also another option where you can actually get the letter to Karain, and if you tell him, he'll give you five gratitude crystals. But this way it was much funnier. So I'm gonna say that's it for this episode. So thank you guys all so very much for watching. I've been Brave Last, and we will end off in our room. So I'll see you guys here for the next one. Bye.